Hey guys, welcome back to my channel and to a new Painted Flanges release video. Today we are going to be talking about the Painted Flanges Faces Collection, and I am way excited to share this one with you. So May is Mother's Day, and it had me thinking a lot about my own mom and my children and our interactions with each other, and I decided to pull some of that into this collection. Some of these polishes are named after phrases that are very common in my house. You will notice there is a fairly strong theme here. These polishes are all pink. My mom has an extreme dislike for the color red, so I definitely tried to kind of steer these colors a little bit more towards colors that my own mom would wear, and also threw in some fun so it wasn't just a plain pink collection for everybody else. So let's talk about them. First we have I love your face, which is a common phrase, not only in my house, but out of my mouth. I tell everybody I love your face because I do. <laughs> this polish is a bright pink jelly polish, maybe bordering on red. It has some gorgeous shifting flakies in here and iridescent glitter which catch the light. It's beautiful. I'm not sure that you can get this completely opaque at three coats, but it builds up and you can see everything in there so well. This polish also layers very nicely over a polish underneath as long as you're aware that the color will change the color of your base polish. You're gonna see three coats of I Love Your Face. Your Face is a white curly polish with different sizes and colors of gold and pink glitter in here and some golden hollow micro glitter. I love this polish. It is what I have on my nails today. I think that it's very feminine and delicate and I think the kick of fun from the color glitters in there just pushes it over the top. So you're going to see three coats of I Miss Your Face. Next we have shut your face, which sounds like a horrible thing to say, but it's really not in my house. Um, when my kids were small, shut up was not a word that was allowed in my house because I think it's rude. Um, it's actually still not allowed in my house. So my oldest son would say shut your face and he would always say it with a smile. It always made me laugh and so now we all say shut your face and other people think we're crazy. So we had to have a shut your face polish. This one has a beigey neutral nude color base. It is packed full of different sizes and shapes of matte glitter. And there are again some fun flakies in this one. These glitter are heavy so because they are a little bit of larger shapes. So this polish can definitely benefit from being put upside down for a little bit before you go to paint your nails with it to make sure that they are as much off the bottom as they can be. I really haven't had any trouble painting my nails with this, but just be aware these polish or these glitters are just a bit more heavy, so you may want to take that into consideration. I'm going to show you three coats of Shut Your Face. And next, the Born to Sparkle polish that I had for my granddaughter Cameron was so loved that I did not bring it back, but I made a very similar polish. This one is called Baby Face. Okay, if I change spots, I had to get up and get Born to Sparkle so I could show you. Baby Face is this one, and Born to Sparkle is right here on my right. So Born to Sparkle is definitely a more of a coral pink, and Baby Face is more of a straight up pink polish. This polish has the delicate shifty flakies that Born to Sparkle had, and it does have a gorgeous copper shimmer in there. So you're gonna see two coats of Baby Face. And 
last but not least, we have a fun polish that I had to throw in. I love zombie themed polishes. I love anything Halloween themed. And this one was inspired by a polish that I had quite a hard time tracking down. This polish has a fleshy, barely pink toned base with a bunch of different sizes of red and red hollow glitter shapes and shreds. It also has some black hollow glitter in there and some gold hollow micro glitter. I love the way that this one turned out. I'm not even sure I told you the name since it was a zombie inspired polish. This one is named Face the Zompocalypse and I'm gonna show you three coats of Face the Zompocalypse. <laughs> The Faces Collection will be available May 15th on my website at paintedflanges.com. They will be $11 each or $50 for the full set. Which one of these polishes was your favorite, guys? Thank you so much for watching and spending this time with me, and I will see you guys in the next video. Bye, guys!